Hey everybody, it's me, Larasha, at What's the Chatter? What's the ch 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 Chatter, Larasha? Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Again, thank you for being here. Again, this is a brand new channel that I created. This is the eighth day that this channel has been up <clears throat> on YouTube. So I want to just say thank you to everybody that has subscribed so far um, and supporting this channel. Again, new things as far as when it comes to, you know, the treasure box, the way that I'm doing it on this channel and then bring in the X-rated videos as well. Um, so make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Share it with your family and friends. Put it on your social media platforms. You know, thank you again, like I said, for the support and the love in this channel. We already have over a thousand subscribers that fast. And it is just a, a happy experience, um, an amazing experience just to see that, again, the treasure box has your names in it. So you get to really see the situations that's take that has taken part of that you took part of soul and spirit wise um, with your masculine, your feminine, the people that have been around you, regardless of those are family, friends, you know, enemies, people that have been hidden and so on. So make sure you like, subscribe and then other people's things that they're going through, especially like celebrities, because you know that they have been part of the scheme in the master plan too in the background, along with, you know, the ones that have been controlling a small people. OK, but again. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Again, thank you for being here at What's the Chatter? What's the ch 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 Chatter LaRasha? And this is going to be a, a week uh, since the week is getting ready to come about. Today is Sunday, you know, so I'm going to go ahead and put out y'all's weekly um, reading for next week already up front so you can watch that and see exactly what energies um that is taking place situations as far as when it comes to the treasure box so make sure you like subscribe comment as well as share again thank you for being here okay um song that's all right now is poke it out by wale poke it out stick it out poke it out so what if she got a little butt okay is what i just heard so let's go the next song is find a way featuring little baby little uh dirk and her is playing in the background. If you can hear the music, if there's any signed songs that uh, resonate with you and your soul and spirit journeys, you know, they're playing for you and it's for a reason. So again, this is going to be a weekly treasure box reading for all signs for the collective weekly treasure box reading for all signs for the collective using the Kipper and the Gilded Deck together. Weekly treasure box reading for all signs for the collective make sure you have your cup you know i got my cup i got some coffee up in here it don't matter what's up in your cup they don't need to know what's in your cup i don't need to know what's in your cup unless you want to tell me but other than that they need to mind their business stay in their lane so we got a, a, a mature woman here you know you the woman with the rose is here so you could be you know expecting a text message, some type of communication. You know, some of y'all could be receiving flowers or a flower from your man or even your woman. If you are a woman that's watching this and you are bisexual, same thing for the masculines. You know which energy you're in, regardless if it's same-sex relationship, if they're the man in the relationship or if you're the woman, same sex. But again, if you are this, you could be waiting something, you know, Waiting for a certain situation to take place is what I'm hearing. And it could be on full throttle is what I just heard. Something that you have been waiting for is getting ready to be on full throttle. Um, next week, you have a 29 here. You got 11. 11 represents twin flame, twin ray, divine partner, life partner, divine soulmates. And then it also represents ones, birth presents new beginnings. There could be somebody that could be getting. So they'll say if there is two different women and there's a man here, you could have been expecting for this woman to get caught and you they're getting exposed as a false person this week is what i just heard this person was trying to block this masculine or feminine from going towards your house a wealthy man could have been involved if it's not a woman that was in the middle it could be a woman and a man it could have been a false lover for your masculine and then a wealthy man that could have been in the way and stopping this masculine or this feminine or this masculine from going towards you because you in this waiting energy. Like, where is my masculine at? So they could have got a false lover and it could have been a wealthy man. If, Like I said, if you are same sex relationship, you know what, what shoes you wear. If you got masculines that are into men. Same thing. Somebody was paying somebody to stay. Keeping them from your house is what I heard. Somebody could be going to jail. Somebody, this wealthy woman, there's two people getting ready to get locked up next week. It's a wealthy man and a false lover or a false woman that got paid to bring 
distracting distractions to this relationship between your masculine or feminine. Somebody's getting ready to get go to jail. It could have been a street rap, uh, street rap, alley rat vibes. It could be a middle of both. And there could have been a wealthy man that was the one that was keeping things going when it comes to this false lover or like I said, keeping this masculine from going or this woman from going towards your house. Your masculine could be, if there's not another masculine that's involved, your masculine could be the wealthy man. And again, this other woman that came between y'all relationship, they could have been in it for the money, could have stole something from this wealthy man. Never let the paper change us. So somebody could be coming to your house. You could be waiting for this person to come house to your house. It could be. Some of y'all could be ending a relationship with a false wealthy man. If you are a feminine that is involved with a false wealthy man, I feel like, okay, so here's a gamble. So somebody was taking chance, rolled the gamble, didn't work in their favor when it comes to, again, trying to block this masculine from going towards you to your house um, or going, you know, selling away from this false lover is what I'm hearing. You have a 39 here. 11 that's reversed i mean nine a 12 song that's on right now is mm -mm -mm. okay by uh kayla kyla kylie or kyla okay so you got a 12 here which is a three so there was a third party inter interference that was there that blocked this masculine from going towards you not realizing that you were the key. You got 33 energy. Whoa, shit. So if two people getting ready to go to jail, it's because of 33 energy. Yeah, somebody was paid unexpectedly in order to block this key. There goes that 33 energy. It's 12-12-12 per portal. So this is this 12-12-12 portal is pushing out these two people to get locked up this week. Unexpected income. They're both getting, he's getting arrested for playing. Okay. See, this is what these people don't understand <laughs> with these chosen people. Let's say with these night owls, you know, they night owls. Yes. Yeah, street walkers, whatever. She a motherfucking street walker, prostitute and escort. It can be day, street, night, whatever. And these wealthy men pay these prostitutes or these strippers or somebody that lay for money or lay for drugs in order for an exchange for a favor or whatever. They can get prosecuted for prostitution. You are paying you. You are pretty much putting making this woman lay down for sex. So that's like a pro, it's like a, another way of prostitution, a form of prostitution. You're taking money to have sex in order to scheme to keep somebody there. Now it's even bigger because there's a big master plan behind it and keeping this masculine or this feminine and this gambling energy when it comes to their other counterpart. So this is not working in this night walker, street walker, street walker, alley rat, street vibes and this whoever this man was that got the money to pay out of the pocket. It ain't working in their favor because they was trying to block your bath, trying to walk, block your masculine from drinking your bath water. <laughs> <laughs> that's what i just heard was trying to watch try to drop just trying to stop your masculine from drinking your bath water so look at you got passed so they were trying to come in your way of the path between you and your masculine or feminine again the government sees you they getting ready to prosecute these two people because they see you as high honor this system even sees you as high honor let's just say if somebody lied on the stand or they try to falsify records said you did this did that or you will you was the one that was prostituted them and they it's the court case or something like that if any of that shit is they out of there because this go the the government whatever court system if it's a police officer that's a whatever whoever got this case they seeing you as a, a high honored individual when it comes to these false people yeah when you when it comes to these false people these snakes the snakes they getting ready to give them the cutoff. And you're getting ready to move forward. You and your masculine and feminine getting ready to move forward in this situation. So there's a man and a woman that's getting ready to go to jail. Could this be a couple? You don't know. But it could. it's a man and a woman that's involved. Yeah. Oh, it could be a family member. It's a family member that was trying to keep you and your masculine and feminine in a maze. So it's a family member. Mm. They was trying to keep this masculine or feminine from going towards you. 
for keeping them in a maze. So you got a 21 here, which is a three. Threes represent your 3D body now connecting with your 5D spirits, 5D soul. So it could definitely be two family members or a family member could have been involved with playing this prostitute, this night walker. If you got a family member that's a night walker, it was two of your family members or whatever that was scheming in this situation. You got a 43 here. A seven, seven represents mystery, seeing signs, synchronicities, having DNA activations. Mm. Somebody could be losing their house. They would have to sell their house. Okay, so let's say if they did this and you, divine feminine, divine masculine, was on these people court case records and they lied on the stand and all that stuff. And this wealthy man has money. They're in, let's say if they make them say, okay, well now since you lied on this, you're going to go to jail. Plus you're going to have to pay them for victims money or something like that. This person possibly has to end up selling their assets in order to pay you for being victimized to a crime that you didn't even commit. So this person, like I told you, it did not work in this person's favor at all. Yeah, you getting ready to get a deed to somebody's house is what I'm hearing. This main woman is, it's going to be ready to be a official situation with this masculine or this feminine. You got a 27, another nine here. So you got two 27s here. You got two 29s here. You can't touch this. Okay, so uh, treasure box reading for the collective. Treasure box reading for the collective. We have rows, so you got another nine. So nine's coming out strong. Nine, nine, nine could be very significant. Nine represents movement, taking action. It also represents moving on. So you could be moving on from the situation with this family situation. Let's say if it's not even uh, your masculine, it could be your family members could have records to a house. And they were trying to get you to set, like, let's say if your master, if your ancestors left you deeds to a house or deeds to land, this other person that had possession to these documents is getting ready to get prosecuted because they schemed up a way to try to get you put in jail or use your masculine to get you put in jail or get both of y'all put in jail. Um, and your masculine could have rolled the, the dice and gambled, especially if he got involved in a situation with a family member or a prostitute or somebody he was not supposed to be sleeping with. It just made your masculine go into a situation or this feminine go a situation that they didn't need to go into. And it could definitely be, like I said, a mature man. There's a mature man that's getting ready to get prosecuted. There could have been falsified documents in order for him to get this land or get these deeds or whatever it is, this will. But they getting ready to get... And, and let's say if you didn't know about this, this case, this gov, the government or this police officer or this constable is going to come deliver you these papers. They're going to give, have to give you flowers. Just know you're getting flowers from this government. Yeah, they come into your house to bring it and it could be your masculine. That's getting ready to do that. But like I said, you could be getting one flower from the government with a documents or a letter of a case. And then your masculine could be coming in with a bouquet. I feel like you're getting two sets of flowers. But I feel this masculine feminine sees you as a lover. You have a 24 energy here. So that's a six. Six represents past hum uh, harmony. And you got a four here. Four represents your stability, taking back control. This is getting ready to allow you to take back control of your family you getting ready to be controlled. You're going to be ready. You're getting ready to be the head honcho of your bloodline is what I just heard with these documents. Rich, you getting ready to be rich. Somebody getting ready to be rich. It's going to be unexpected income. You possibly won a, ca a court case that you didn't even know. Or like I said, there was some, some scheming that was going around with some yeah, three, three, selling away. Somebody stole something that they was not supposed to be st stole. So yeah, this masculine or feminine could have rolled the dice, gambled with somebody that was either younger than him, or I say if this masculine slept with one of your ancestors that was younger, or if this prostitute or this streetwalker was younger, or even if it was a masculine or a woman, um, it 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 was a, a a plot to stop this masculine from selling away from you. Also, cause you to not be. Stable enough to receive this money or whatever because that masculine was a dominant masculine that was in your life. They try to use your masculine's reckless behaviors to stop you from getting this money. 
is what I just heard. Yeah, somebody mask is getting ready to come off. Somebody could be finding out somebody was married too. Yeah, application. So I feel like if it's wealthy one man, it could have paid. That's what I said. This could be life partner energy. It could be, again, somebody paying for something. It could have been an employer that could have been this wealthy man that could have tried to stop you. If one of you, somebody in your workplace was sleeping with your masculine or feminine or they was sleeping with somebody in their workplace. Yeah, this is not going to work in favor for this job. Some of y'all could be getting a lawsuit from you could be getting it could have been a family member and an employer that went hand in hand in this scheming. And you're getting ready to get two forms of income. You're going to find out who these snakes is through this court. This court system getting ready to be loyal to you. The song that's on right now is already won. You already won. And you don't know it. You got the, the again, this. Yeah. Somebody coming in with a ring. So you could have a, a, a lawsuit, case for, lawsuit case for an employer and a family member. Yeah, message of concern, you're going to be shocked, is what I just heard. You're going to be shocked as hell. You got a five. It could be a tower moment, but it's a tower moment because you got some money coming to you. And whatever's on this documentation is going to shock the shit out of you, is what I just heard. So some two people getting ready to go to jail. A wealthy man and a false lover, a false woman. And I said one of them could be family member, an employer. You know which what it is. It's two people. Just know that. You already won. You won a case that you didn't even know you won. Uh, so again, uh, treasure week, treasure uh, reading for the collective treasure, weekly reading for the collective, treasure weekly reading for the collective, treasure weekly reading for the collective. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Again, thank you for being here at this channel of What's the Chatter, LaRasha. Um, again, thank y'all. I still have my regular channel, Goddess Queen, Just Me, but this one is going to be a little bit different. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Seven of Cups, so somebody's letting go of their options. They want to have a brand new start. There's inspiration. Like I told you, you are inspiration to this court system. Because you're pushing a certain judgment and karma, the necessary energy that they need to dish out everybody else's karma is what I just heard. So you have Aries, Leo as well as Sagittarius. You got judgments, Aries, Leo as a Sagittarius. Somebody getting ready to get judged. Going for, like I said, they lied on the court stand. And if they get lied on the court stand, in order to say that you did this, they out of there. It could be a Pisces that could be involved. But like I said, something getting ready to come to surface as far as when it comes to a secret, a secret court case or these secret options that was working behind the scenes that your master and feminine put you in a third party situation with. Eight of Cups, they walking away from a certain situation. You walking away from a certain situation. There's three women here. So your masculine or your, your this masculine could have walked away from three different women. They see you as the Ten of Cups. You already won. And the secret could be that they are just coming in to start a brand new situation. They're on this, they have a backpack on, they on this journey energy. So they going towards you while they walking away from something that is no longer serving them. They cutting away something. They coming in and giving you victory and the praise. Page of Swords, you got Aquarius, Libra, as well as Gemini. Could be, uh, oh, shoot. Three twenty-five on the dashboard. This person could be speeding towards you because, like I said, Eight of Cups walking away from a certain situation. So we got Treasure, we got Page of Wands, you got Aries, Liz, Willis, Sagittarius. This person is in this adventure energy, right? They see a lot of potential when it comes to this relationship. I feel like this masculine or feminine is getting ready to be very direct when it comes to their words and their passion. Again, they're putting in action. Something was a spark lit underneath somebody's ass, especially if they were dealing with a, a court case or you were dealing with a court case. Um, 
Yeah, Aries, Aquarius, Libra, as well as Gemini, be, and then Virgo energy being reversed. So some of y'all could be letting go of a um, an air sign or a Virgo, somebody that was on childish behavior. You got the Page of Wands. They could have been very immature with this Page of Wands and this Page of Swords. Childish with their communication, always fighting, always starting arguments, thinking that they were right, never wanting to talk things out. You know, always saying fast things with, you know, flashy with their their uh, their words, being petty on the side. Somebody definitely could be stalking you. This masculine is out of is 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 out of this reckless energy that was a part of their judgment. Reckless, uh, not using their intuition, very misguided. Four of Swords. This uh, this person was up at night. I ain't begging when I tell the bitch please. So if they getting ready to turn, cut off an an uh, air sign or a Virgo. Um, is going to keep this person up at night is what I'm hearing. Seven of Cups because it was a past life connection with this person. They possibly knew this person in their past or you knew this person in their past. But somebody's moving away from another situation because you got the Ace of Cups. There's definitely third party energy here. Somebody's left and letting go of their options for sure. A Libra. This Libra could have been the one they're letting go of. This is not good. Airport energy is what I just heard. So somebody getting ready to get... Somebody can get rested in the airport if they ain't going to get rested in the airport. Like I told you, uh, uh, they got to... It could be an air sign. An air sign. You got air sign energy here that's reverse. Or a Virgo that could begin going to jail. But you got Aquarius, Libra, as well as Gemini. You got this Libra reverse. You have this full energy, which is Aaron Virgo. You have this Ace of Wands, Aries, Leo, as well as Sagittarius. You got this Judgment, Aries, Leo, as well as Sagittarius. You got Pisces energy here in the Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, as well as Sagittarius. This, mas this feminine or this masculine, whoever the one that was doing the scheming, like I said, is not working in their favor. That shit completely backfired. Yeah, tower moment. And I'm going to stop right there. Somebody could be experiencing a death and one could be going to jail. The song that's on right now is Wukisha by Moneyback Joe. Somebody could be having a house fire is what I'm hearing. Some two people getting ready to go to jail. So we got Aries, Leo, Zula, Sagittarius. This represents Scorpio. Scorpio on top of Scorpio. Again, if it's family members, if any of these people are your family members or your masculine or feminine family members, you did see family in there. And like I told you, there was a woman, there was street rab, uh, alley rat vibes, street walker vibes, night walker vibes. So that could be any of the mix that's in this, but somebody definitely getting ready to have a tower moment that they didn't see coming. I'm sitting here knowing I don't need you. Can't get my mind off of Waukesha. She in my feelings, she my therapist. Do you love me not? Seven of Cups, options. Damn, you hit the spot. So somebody getting ready to get judgment for something. Especially if they lied on, on, on the stand, bro. If somebody lied on the stand, they out of there. They looking very foolish right now to these court systems. Okay, so make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. And you have a thank y'all for being here. Here I go, popping back up like. And I flipped out like that, so I'm going to take that on the table. Looking out my window, that lady in the first cart with the rose. Pack my bags, airport energy or something. I was walking away from a situation. Like I told you, somebody getting ready to come with a backpack. Stop playing with my heart.
one minute I'm done with you, the next thing I'll be running back. Fly than most. Oh my goodness. I ain't taking all that. That's a lot. This right here is a lot. But it is what it is. Let's go ahead and get this started. Let me make sure. I'm too sexy for my shirt. So this is going to be a treasure box reading for all signs for the collective. Okay. Okay, so make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, as well as share again. Thank y'all for being here. Okay. An abusive niece. So somebody has an abusive niece. <laughs> it says, get your nails done. So somebody needs to go get their nails done. R.I.P. to an abusive niece. It says accepting, uh, accepting what is. So you could be accepting what is when it comes to this abusive niece. Mm. Are your masculine could be accepting what it what it is when it comes to this their abusive niece? If they have an abusive niece that's involved with this. Okay, so accepting what is too sexy for this shirt. <clears throat> so it says somebody was on that money, cars, and clothes, and hoes energy. So again, that seven of, of cups energy is reversed. So they no longer on this energy. A abusive niece could have been an option to one of your masculines or your feminine. Somebody named Elena, Al Alana. Writing over this stuff. So I'm gonna have to write over it again while it comes out of this basket. I'm too sexy for this fame. So if some of y'all got a, a, na a niece name, uh, Al Alana, Al Al Anna, or Al Anna, is that how you pronounce it? Then it is what it is. You accepting what it is, what it is. It says a lot of emotions that have been held inside. So there's a lot of emotions that have been held inside. It says someone. Someone is ashamed. So this abusive niece could be ashamed or somebody named uh, Lana could be ashamed. Somebody might need a prosthetic. Someone is ashamed. It says you're easy on the eyes. So you could be very easy on the eyes. Divine feminine, divine masculine. It says happiness that was overlooked. So this masculine uh, overlooked you this whole time. Again, you was a 10 of cups and it was happiness that was overlooked. It says using woman for sex. So somebody was using woman for sex. Using women for sex, excuse me. Again, 
If they paid your mat, if they, if there was anything with prostitution, again, that's using or whoever this, this person is that paid the street walker to sleep with your masculine or feminine, using woman for sex. Your masculine could be involved in this too because you got this money cars and uh, money cars, clothes, hoe energy. So using uh, women for sex. It says your masculine slept with your nephew. So your masculine slept with your nephew. Again, you got an abusive ass aunt niece here. So your niece could know about that. So there's niece and uh, nephew energy here. Somebody named uh, Edgar. Somebody hired a hitman. So this is the situation where, like I told you, somebody getting ready to go to jail because them being involved in hiring a hitman. If it was one of your ancestors, like I said, there was ancestor energy here with a great, uh, an abusive niece and um, a uh, your, your masculine slept with your nephew. That could be involved with this hitman energy. It says someone you fought when you was younger. So it could be someone that you fought when you was younger could have been involved in this hitman energy as well. Are the setting up. So all the people that you fought when you were younger, if you did get in a fight, okay, this could be this person. Someone is feeling ashamed, especially if they hired a hitman um, to try to take you out because they still upset that you whooped their ass. That's that is the dumbest way to to end your contract in this lifetime. But it is what it is. That was a part of that person's role. It says ready to talk things out. So this masculine is ready to talk things out. Or somebody could be ready to talk things out. It could be this abusive niece or this nephew that slept with your masculine or your, ne or your masculine himself. If he did do that, so a credit score. So your credit score could be going up or somebody could have been doing, you know, background checks to see exactly what was your credit score and any of that shit. Somebody could have did a background check and pull your credit score and your credit score was higher than theirs. And they could be the one that's feeling ashamed. Since your credit score could be significant, could be going up. It said it was uh, destined to change. So your credit, your credit score was destined to change. Okay, somebody named Malcolm. Any of these people could have been involved and hiring a hitman and they could be feeling uh they could be feeling ashamed so somebody named Malcolm somebody named Isabel any of these people could be people that you went to school with somebody named Isabel it says de de divine masculine being childish is backfiring. So again, if he was in that page of swords or that page of wands energy, him being childish is backfiring and he's feeling ashamed. It says get out of jail car free. So somebody getting ready to get have a get out of jail car free. Are you getting ready to have a get out of jail car free? Because you were not the one that was using women for sex. You didn't hire no hitman. You was not pulling nobody credit score or any of that. Uh, these other people were involved with that and like I told you, you and your masculine getting ready to get have a get out of jail free, any of those people could have a get out of jail free card if they were not involved with Hitman okay is what I just heard so it says Karmic slept with Divine Masculine's cousin so this Karmic slept with Divine Masculine's cousin, somebody last name Brown hot girl shit so she was on her hot girl shit Isabel uh, Elena and Brown or Mike Malcolm or Edgar, they was on a hot girl, hot boy shit. Uh, somebody named Ginger. You ain't going to respond to my texts. So Ginger. Okay, so it says failed project by the family. So definitely was a failed project by your family. It says, I deeply damaged divine feminine. I don't, I'm deeply damaged divine feminine. I don't know the real me. So this masculine is saying 
that they are deeply damaged or any of those people could be saying that they deeply damaged and they don't know the real you, them. Your abusive niece or your nephew could feel that way too. A boy cousin could be involved. Your boy cousin could be the one that could be damaged and don't know the real him. If any of those people's name is your boy cousin, they could have been involved with a uh, hit man using women for sex, ready to talk things out. People saw your struggle, so this person could have saw your struggle, or a boy cousin could have saw your struggle. San Antonio could be very significant. It says more than a best friend, divine feminine. So this masculine is saying that you are more than a ju uh, just a best friend, divine feminine. Somebody last name Baker, Jordan, Tommy, Timothy. It says divine masculine, you let that bitch control you, so you let that bitch control you. His friends and his dad hate me. So that your own family could have been part of controlling your masculine. Again, Phil Project by the family. It says, Divine Masculine, you let that bitch control you. Somebody named Sharla. Hmm. Failed Project by the family. Wow, best friend, best friend. So bed, bed friend. I thought I said, he said best friend, but bed friend by Jarkees is on. But somebody named Sharla. Somebody named Bruce. So somebody named Bruce. Guilty. So like I said, guilty as charged. Somebody named Juan. There's so many things that I want to say. Somebody named Juan. Somebody named Julia. Tired of pretending. These could all be the certain woman that was your mask could have been sleeping with. Somebody named Julia. Last name Wyatt. It says, wants to wake up to you every day. So somebody last name Wyatt or any of those names, Julia could want to wake up to you um, every day. You're more than a best friend. Okay. Um, it says somebody named Ronell. Ronell. It says, wants to start over. So somebody named Ronell or last name Wyatt could want to start over. Started off as your best friend. How did we both go from kicking it to sexing? So this person wants to start over. Somebody named Don. All could have been people that de divine masculine. You let that bitch control you. It could be any of those names as well. Um, your brother could be involved because you do have a niece and a nephew situation. So again, brother energy is here. Brother could have also been involved in hiring a hitman. Or it could be somebody your brother fought a long time ago when he was younger that could be involved in this as well. It says divine feminine is making sure divine masculine learned his lesson. So divine feminine, you are making sure that your masculine learned his lesson. Somebody last name, Matt Clinton. Last name, Matt Clinton. It says uh, the, the sister likes the other sister. So the sister likes the other sister. So one of the sisters, if you know any of those people are sisters over there, the sister likes the other sister. It says just wants to kiss and make up. So somebody just wants to kiss and makes up. They want to start over and somebody named TJ. So there could be, let's say if you have brother energy, sister energy over here, nephew, niece energy over here, stepdad, stepmom energy over here, mama, daddy energy over here. Again, you got a cousin, boy, cousin. So it could be cousin energy and uncle and niece. I mean, aunt energy as well, because you got abusive niece. So it could be, you know, your grandma niece or your daddy niece. It don't necessarily have to be you as the niece. 
You see what I'm saying? So it could be one of your brother, your daddy's niece, your brother niece, one of your cousin's niece could be involved in that as well. So, but you know which situation that you're in. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this started. So it says, go get your nails done. Okay, somebody was involved with money, cars, uh, clothes, and hoes. It says, uh, divine feminine is making sure divine masculine learned his lessons, possibly from this money, cars, and clothes, uh, clothes and hoes energy. Um, divine feminine is make ma divine feminine is making sure divine masculine learned his lesson. Happiness that was overlooked. Okay. Um, it was destined to change. So things were destined to change. Somebody is accepting what it is. Okay. Uh, a credit score could be involved. Your credit score could be changing or your masculine or feminine's credit score could be changing as well. It says, um, a brother could be involved. Okay. Let me put this down. Let me put this down. Okay. Um, okay. So. Let's go here. Fail project by family, okay? A brother could be involved. There's a, the sister likes the other sister. Your masculine slept with your nephew. There's an abusive niece that's involved. Um, someone is, uh, is ashamed and it could be one of your family members, your brother, your niece, or your nephew. Um, somebody was using, uh, women for sex. It says, you, Divine Masculine, you let that bitch control you. Uh, divine uh, Masculine being childish is backfiring. Somebody was involved in hiring a hitman. A boy cousin could be involved. Cut, karmic slept with Divine Masculine's cousin, which was a boy cousin. Okay. Um, it says, uh, Someone you fought when you was younger. So if those anybody that you fought when you were younger or your brother fought when they were younger. Uh, San Antonio could be very significant. It says, I'm deeply damaged, divine feminine. I don't know the real me. So somebody does not know the real them because they deeply damaged. It says, people saw your struggle, wants to start over. Somebody has a get out of jail free card. It says a lot of emotions that's been hidden inside and it definitely possibly could be your masculine. It says just wants to kiss and make up. You're easy on the eyes. More than a best friend, Divine Feminine. Ready to talk things out. So somebody's ready to talk things out and wants to wake up to you every day. And we're going to go and, and that's what we have for this situation. And here are the names. So it's first name, last name, match up, last name, first name, middle name, first name, middle name, last name, nickname, first name, nickname, last name, first name, last name, nickname, first uh, middle name. If that all four come out, then they ass is in, uh, is in trouble. But again, if one of them come out, it's still that aha moment, that necessary trigger moment for you in a good way or a bad way. So last name is McClinton, Wyatt. Barker, I mean Baker, but Barker could be involved. Last name Brown, Julia, Sharla, Ginger, Isabel, Alana, Al, Al, Al Anna, is that how you say that? Al Anna, TJ, Don. Ronell, I saw my big brother today, Juan, Bruce, Malcolm, and Edgar. And these people could be involved, involved, involved in hiring a hitman or was using women for sex. Or, like I said, uh, could be um, blood-sucking leeches, I just heard. I don't know. But some of these people could have been overlooking their happiness when it came to you. And I'm going to go ahead and end this. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. And y'all have a great day. And again, thank y'all for being here at What's the Chatter, LaRasha? What's the ch ch chatter? Peace and y'all stay safe.